And welcome back to some more Mass Effect 2. Uh, so I'm having I'm having a little trouble remembering what the last thing we did was. Uh, I think we did a whole bunch of the like DLC side missions, um, where we were pretty much just doing. We did the Firewalker missions. We did Project Lazarus, I think, which was uh, absolutely horrifying. Uh, I think I'll keep that one. I'll take that one. Take that. What's this one? Storm speed 10%. Health by 10%. Okay, there we go. And casual appearance. I would like to look like this, please. Hey, 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 wait a minute. That's not what I... There we go. That's better. Um, I'm all down with getting, uh, you know, fancied out, getting suited up, but uh, not trying to do that all the time. Alright. So now we should probably go get ourselves some more teammates. Let's see what do we got. What do we got? What do we got? Mass relays this way. How do you pronounce that? Hecate? Hades Nexus. just now popping up. But, whatever. Alright, uh, where else are we going? So we have to... We have to recruit the Warlord, and actually it looks like that might be the only thing we have. Hang on, my sound is kind of low. Um, Alright, so we're right here. I'm gonna exit. Wait, have I leveled up? I have leveled up, but I would like to level up Concussive Shot completely. Um, Alright, anything else? No, that's just the Smuggling Depot. Okay, so we can do whatever we want! Set. Let's go. The dossier doesn't say if Okir is on this planet by choice. Assume hostiles. There is only one measure of success. Kill or be killed. Perfection is your goal. Hang on. So dialogue is fine. Speakers. Someone likes the sound of their voice. Stay focused. We're looking for a Krogan warlord. Being hired is merely the beginning. You must earn your place in the mighty army we are building. There we go. Look out, post ahead. And they're ready for us. Going to <laughs> Taking. <sighs> Shit, shit, 
shit. I won't stop bleeding. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Son of a bitch. Doesn't look that bad, actually. He doesn't need to know that. <laughs> I knew it wasn't berserkers. Ah, not at range. You're mercs. Or alliance. I'm not... I'm not telling you anything. I've got a nice application of Metagel ready to go. But if you'd rather I just keep walking... Son of a bitch. I just... <laughs> I don't know anything. I just shoot the overflow from the labs. The old Krogan up there, he, he's really been cleaning house lately. Jador hired him to make her an army, but the Krogan he creates are insane. So we use them for live ammo training. It's all crap. I don't get paid enough to goddamn bleed out. Outpost hey, Jador, squeaker. We need coordinates on that Krogan pack. What's up? How you doing? I want your friends gone. Understand? Uh, patrol, the last group dispersed. Lost sight five minutes ago. Dispersed? Jadora will be pissed. She wanted a show. You asked for a report, you got it. Dispersed. Understood. Returning to the labs. There. You see? I'm helping. If you start limping now, you might find a shady spot before you bleed out. Shit. Oh, shit. Oh. I'm doing okay. Why'd um, you so soon? Some people need a heavy hand. I just got through like four hours worth of prep and cooking for a really huge and kind of like frustratingly complicated meal. Hostiles, stay strong. Shield them. Yep. But you know what? It's gonna be worth it. I didn't even get to have any. I don't know if we're gonna cook tonight yet. Unfortunately, I didn't get to have any before I went on the air because I didn't have any time. I just barely got it done in time for me to get on the air, and as is, I'm an hour late. So, I'm going to have to, you know, ease some when I'm done. I'm looking forward to it. Nah, that guy didn't die. Where'd he go? Shot. Ah, uh, almost got him. That would have forgiven you if you ate before it was more late. I mean, probably, but it's a matter of me not feeling okay with it. Then stay down. Cause like I am, I'm already late beyond my scheduling, and I usually don't get to eat before stream. It was just, I started really early in hopes that I would, and I still did not. I'm okay with you not eating. I will be fine. I promise to eat, and I made a lot. I will eat just fine. You are different. New. You don't smell like this world. Seven night cycles, and I have felt only the need to kill. But you... Something makes me speak. Night cycles. Seven days. They must breed them full size, ready to kill. Not much improvement over regular mercs if they need training. Bread to kill. No, I kill because my blood and bone tell me to. But it's not why I was flushed from Glass Mother. Survival is what I hear in my head. Against the enemy that threatens all my kind. But I failed, even before waking. That is what the voice in the water said. That is why I wait here. Uh, I mean, I would say the same thing. I'd say you should have eaten, you should have taken here. longer. The 
but also if you promise that you gonna eat, take care of yourself afterwards. I'm not planning on streaming four or five hours. If I was settling down for like a marathon, like that Bloodborne stream where I went on for like six and a half hours, that would have been a little. But I like it. I. You fleshy things are slow when big things are in your way. You could have run or tried to fight your way back to the lab. <laughs> Use for Let's my, my pants. I am waiting. The voice told me, if they come, I fight. But I will not run. And I will not follow. I am not perfect, but I have purpose. I must wait until called. Released. I got too excited. <laughs> Brain got a lot of room to Stay short. Fire. Don't see anybody else. Ready to die. She just punched him in the face and he died. Sheesh. Right? Okay, good. Huh? Hi. But yeah, I decided to put that as a redeem. I made it high point and on a cooldown so people can't spam it. Because if I do it too many times in a row, it actually hurts. Put in a couple of new commands that I think you might uh, enjoy. Hey Rayleigh, welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. Have some head pads. <laughs> this might be useful. Ooh, sniper rifle damage. Yes. Gimme. Look straight ahead. Bah. <laughs> How you doing today, really? Raised his shoulder. Don't die now. Right in the face. <laughs> the fact that she just laughs at them. That's awesome. 
what do we got here? Ooh, PDA. Ah, uh, I need that patch too, and it's blocked. Oh no, they're all blocked. Here we go. Out of my way! I'm so sad that headshot actually missed. Going dark. Fire in the hole. Come on. That was a waste of a bullet. right and I'm gonna kill every single one of you. You know why? Because standing in my way is a bad idea. My health. Right in the face. Concussive shot ready. You filled your whole armor bar with one HP left. It's a damn shame. <laughs> he make funny death sound. Nice. All three side by side. <laughs> Man, imagine being like that to your own boss. Listen, if you don't get out here off your lazy ass. <laughs> What's up, buddy? Welcome in, everyone. How y'all doing? Yeah, lost you. you know, I have almost every Assassin's Creed game, and I've played almost none of them. <laughs> How you doing, man? Thank you so much. <laughs> Tired. 
How long were you on for? I was on I was on your stream for the last several hours, but I don't remember when you started. <laughs> Got a lot of nerve. Seven and a half hours. Jesus. I don't know how y'all do it. I know so many streamers who consistently do time like that. And I barely have the energy to handle, you know, two and a half, three hours at a time. Unless I'm super invested in what's going on in the game and I get, you know, excited, I get adrenaline. But on a typical stream, I, I don't think I could handle seven and a half hours. And you usually pull numbers like that. Ooh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Cover, cover. I mean, true, if the game is good. It's me, Shepard. What you mean? I didn't shoot you. I'm gonna smack you in your face. I didn't even hit you, man. I played Skyrim. I played it for 18 hours straight. Okay. No, 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 no. I think you misunderstand. I can play video games for the whole day. Even more than that. I mean streaming it. Did you stream Skyrim for 18 hours straight? I shut down the security cams as soon as I saw it was you. Never thought I'd say it, but I'm glad it's you shooting up the place. Sorry, ran a Phenoptis. You let me go when you destroyed Saren's lab on Vermeer? Had to outrun a nuke in a utility pod, but it's still a second chance. We're done at 12... Okay. Yeah, see, that's what I mean. I don't have the energy to stream for seven and a half hours on a regular basis. Game ended after nine and a half. I assume you have a good reason for being at this lab. But I, I understand worry, on Skyrim, I love the, the Elder Scrolls TV. series. Oblivion my is my here. absolute Stick favorite out of all of them. Not for the I am tired, tired of Skyrim, track. though. But Okir is trying I to am tired, tired of Skyrim. Extreme. I have the platinum trophy on it twice. Everyone deserves a I am chance, so right? sick of it. <laughs> and sometimes giving one pays off. I take care of my debts. Finding you in a place like this I makes me think okay. where you go was a mistake. So you don't want that. ESO was good. On that. But worry. it got boring. From to do with because I finished every no, side quest. Like I finished all the DLCs that were available at the time work. and they've since released expansions which they didn't have before. She seemed nice um, in that mad scientist ethics for And way. I finished the whole storyline of my people, which I was... I'm trying to remember which side I was. Um, we do love you, Rayleigh. <laughs> oh, she meant Mass Effect. Well, all the same. We love Mass Effect, too. But we love you as well, because you're awesome. I don't know. I have too many friends that just say that as like a command. So I apologize. It's too natural for me. This one. Um, but ESO is good. It's just once you go through it, it doesn't have a lot of replayability. In my opinion. Uh, Skyrim was okay, but once you found everything there is to do, that also gets tiring. I felt that there was a lot more to be had in Oblivion. If you ever get the chance to play it, uh, Danish, what systems do you use? You are. are you PC? Are you progress. Xbox? Are you PlayStation? What do you do? What do you got? It's about time. The batteries on these tanks will not wait while you play with these idiotic mercs. Okay. Oh, you're okay. You don't seem particularly okay. Okay. Do you, okay. Do you have PlayStation 3? You may claim to be here to help, but the formerly deceased shepherd is not a sign of gentle change. Surprise. Fair enough. Fair enough. Krogan should know you. I'm sure Rana has already revisited your actions on Vermeer. I'm sure you're eager to retell the story. Such okay, me too. Me too, Sorry. but I have to check. So, you can either get Oblivion on PS3 with its two biggest expansions, and in my opinion, among the best. Or you can get it on Before Steam where it has Sarin everything, but its controller support sucks. So you'd have to be used to playing it at, on a mouse and keyboard. Like that thought. It has weight. 
but uh, you can get Oblivion on PS3. It's usually like $10, $15. I, I suggest the complete edition because the DLC is absolutely worth it and better on PC anyway. Okay. So get Oblivion and get the expansions. Get Knights of the Nine and um, Realm of the Mad God. I don't remember. Uh, the Shivering Isle. The Shimmering Isles. Or Shivering. I don't remember. Uh, one of those two. Get those because those are the ones that are on the PlayStation. Any others you want, you can get, but just trust me, Oblivion is hands down, for me, the best in the series. And Morrowind is very good as well, but it's that. even older and it doesn't play very good. I'd have considered it. But I approve. Saren's Pale Horde were not true Krogan. Numbers alone are nothing. The mistake of an outsider, one that these mercenaries have also made. I gave their leader my rejects for her army, but she grows impatient. It's time for you to take me out of here. We're here about collectors, not your problems. I see. Yes, collector attacks have increased. A human concern. My requests were focused elsewhere. I acquired the knowledge to create one pure soldier. With that, I will inflict upon the Genophage the greatest insult an enemy can suffer. To be ignored. Mm. Your methods are extreme, but you know how to deconstruct a threat. Will you help us? Perhaps I can strike a deal to secure passage. But my prototype is not negotiable. It is the key to my legacy. Attention. I have I've ever been good at is OSRS. After that, I've never found another I could keep playing. So, I was an MMO fiend as a kid. From middle school through high school, if you gave me an MMO that had half decent design and story, I was trying it out, and I played dozens. She'll try to access contaminants in the storage bay. Now, start over like she plans to. After What's high school, did? into adulthood, nothing. Not a single MMO so has managed to keep it. my it interest, survive. keep my taste. Just none of them hold me anymore. But RPGs in general, and do what ooh, must be done. they are my thing. They are absolutely all I'm all I am about. Then we got those where you had to join the guild and stay in touch. I'll with take you. it. Eh, nah. I never played MMOs that required you to have teammates or get into big groups because I didn't have them. You know, I had a friend or two that played MMOs as well, and we'd play at different times. We'd have different things to do. So I'd always just play what I could on my own. Never stop me. a hard time without just the only ones I could ever... Yeah. Now, there was one that had my attention more than any other, and it is still my favorite MMO of all time. But in recent years, they have completely changed how it functions. Uh, they've changed the basis of the story, the whole beginning of it. They've made it so user-friendly. That it's pretty much, it went from something that you'd have to be at least a teenager to understand to a child could walk on and smack their face against the keyboard and you can play it. And it's honestly oversimplified and not very good in my opinion anymore. Um, they released a classic version um, and ended up uh, making it pay to play. 
after saying the whole basis of Classic was to stop uh, pay to win. It was so stupid. Um, but it held my attention like no other. And it was one where, at first, I was the tank class, because I was the one who would pull aggro, who would be up front. But I needed a team, because you didn't do enough damage by yourself. But then they released a DPS class that had lifesteal and self-healing. Ooh, I beat the whole entire game solo. Never had to worry about it. Even instances that required teams of five people at a time, I just worked my way through, slow and steady. One enemy at a time, just healing off them little by little. It was... it made... it, it shouldn't have been doable, but... It was a lot of fun. And then they ruined it. <laughs> Why would someone so fanatical sacrifice himself for one Krogan? That thing can't be worse than Okir. And if he's tough, we need him. A pure Krogan could pack a hell of a punch. We can always use another heavy hit. If he'll help, I doubt anyone's asked for his opinion. Normandy, Okir is a no-go, but we have a package that needs retrieval. It's the it boy! Look, it's my son! <laughs> Let's see your life so I can raid you. Well, I really appreciate that. It really does mean a lot when people come out to support like that. I don't know why it would make you excited, though. <laughs> yeah, you've said that a few times. I don't know. People now. tell me that all the time, and I never the understand what they mean. Dangerous. This one was created and likely educated by a madman. I see everyone's enjoying the new paperweight. Concerns? <laughs> the new paperweight. We don't know anything about it, Commander. Good job, Hambo. You did great. Uh, have you sent? Have you posted pictures of it anywhere? Well, come in. I Not know. often I get that shit. Fair you enough. That that's easy. fair, that's fair. Krogan fight well at close quarters. Perhaps awakening him in a confined space wouldn't be prudent. Noted. The cargo hold is safe enough while I decide what to do with him. Yeah, I just finished the last one with the painting. I'll post pics tomorrow. And okay. Yeah, because I'm looking forward to seeing the finished product. Ooh. Oh. Apex update. Cool. Yeah, uh, for those of you who play it, costs around 425 and some oof. I mean, for building or rebuilding or just fixing a deck, that doesn't sound that bad. But it also is still a hefty amount of money. Um, also, for those who play Apex, I just got the game. I, I decided I'd download it. I've only seen gameplay a couple of times. I've never played it before, ever. Um, so, you know, if ship? anybody wants to help out with that, <laughs> if anybody's interested, wants to play together, or has any tips for me, what is out? Yeah, it is. Jeez. The subject is stable, Shepard. Integration with onboard systems was seamless. Can he see anything in there? Does he know where he is? Uh, uh, Apex. Current neural patterns indicate minimal cognition. Barring shipwide power loss, the nutrients in the tank could sustain him for over a year. What can you tell me about this guy? Uh, I just got the it. So I was saying, I've never played it, I've only seen gameplay a couple times, I know nothing. I was just asking if anybody had no tips, or if people wanted to play together, or what. Genetic markers of the genophage present in all Krogan. I cannot judge mental functioning. Stand by. I'm gonna open the tank and let him out. Cerberus protocol is very clear regarding untested alien technology. 
He's either a powerful addition to the crew or a time bomb. I'd rather deal with it now. True. Very well, Shepard. The controls are online. The switch and consequences are yours. I don't appreciate that sass, Edie. That's a lie. Yes, I do. I like your sass. Sounds like Batman. <laughs> Wait, what sounds like Batman? Commander Shepard, and I don't take threats lightly. I suggest you relax. Not your name. Mine. I'm trained. I know things. But the tank, Okir couldn't implant connection. His words are hollow. Warlord, legacy, Grunt. Grunt. Grunt was among the last. It has no meaning. It'll do. I am Grunt. If you are worthy of your command, prove your strength and try to destroy me. You wouldn't prefer Okir? Or Legacy? It's short. Matches the training in my blood. The other words are big things I don't feel. Maybe they fit your mouth better. I feel nothing for Okir's clan or his enemies. I'll do what I'm bred to do. Fight and determine the strongest. But his imprint has failed. Without a reason that's mine. One fight is as good as any other. Might as well start with you. I have a good ship and a strong crew. A strong clan. You'd make it stronger. If you're weak and choose weak enemies, I'll have to kill you. Our enemies are worthy. No doubt about that. Hmm. Hmm. That's... acceptable. I'll fight for you. I'm glad you saw reason. Huh? <laughs> offer one hand, but on the other. Uh, that always makes me laugh so much. If I find a clan, if I find what I, I want, I will be honored to eventually pit them against you. Who is Grunt's voice act? Steve Bloom. Okay, I was like, you sound familiar. All right. So now we got Grunt. I like Grunt. Go talk to Jack. Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. I'm still finding out about me. Thanks for letting me look at these files. If they're helping you, that's good enough for me. Don't be my buddy. You need me to kill for you, I need you for these files. Let's leave it there. Your hey. friends at Cerberus are into some nasty things. I'm gonna find something I can use. I just know it. What if the answers aren't what you expect? I'm not looking for answers. I'm looking for names, dates, places. What happens when you find what you're looking for? I go hunting. Anyone who's screwed with me pays. Their associates pay. Their friends pay. The galaxy's gonna be a lot emptier when I'm done. What's your history with Cerberus? They raised me in a research facility. I escaped when I was a kid. Been on the run ever since. And they've been chasing me ever since. But soon, I'm gonna chase them. You don't have to live in this pit, you know. It's dark, quiet, and hard to find. That spells safety to me. You know, this he ship flipped. is a powerhouse. You could go pirate. Live like a king. Yeah. I could help. I could. We have to stop the collector. But I'm a good noodle. Time for in fact, the goodest of noodles Mrs. in all Stone the galaxy. will either be dead or out here in space. With this ship. Think about it. Lots of creds. Freedom to go wherever you want. And all the mayhem and fighting I could want. What is it about killing that fascinates you so much? I figure every time someone dies and it's not me, my chances of survival go up. It's Simple. not inaccurate. I should go. Yep. 
That's not inaccurate. Riku, hello. How are you? Let's go to the CIC. Hi, Zoe. I'm just hanging out, baby. What you doing? Yeah, yeah, we can speak to him. Shepard, I see you awaken Okir's Krogan. A dangerous decision, but you've got free reign on this operation. If you're certain he'll be a useful member of the team, you've got my support. We need every weapon we can in this battle. If this grunt proves unreliable and has to be put down, don't lose the body. He's based at least partially on collector technology and could offer useful genetic data. But again, you are in charge. Jack's tattoos are beautiful. As colorful as her past, I'm sure. I have concerns with her temper, though. You have worries about Jack? I know she'll be solid under fire, but her attitude suggests deep personal issues. She pushes people away, yet approaches sex casually. I don't think she understands her own motivations. I wouldn't be surprised if she makes advances on you. If you want her respect, think twice. I'll do my best not to piss her off. Please warn me if you fail. I want a chance to hide. Anyway, <laughs> how may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? I'll be here if you need anything. Shepard! How can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Some other time. About to test new bioweapon. Not on us, of course. Didn't think I had to specify, but Joker got nervous. <laughs> Anything else? <laughs> Have you got a minute to talk? Some other time. Okay, Anything else? so it's the same thing. We'll be here if you need me. Uh, testing new weapon, pilot. What do you mean? <laughs> Hello, Martin Sheen. Shepard, I think we have them. Horizon, one of our colonies in the Terminus systems, just went silent. That's, if it this isn't is Horizon. Attack, it soon will be. Has Morton delivered the countermeasure for the Seeker Swarms? Not yet. Let's hope he works well under pressure. There's something else you should know. One of your former crew, Ashley Williams, she's stationed on Horizon. Last I knew, Ash was Alliance. Why is she out in the Terminus systems? Officially, it's an outreach program to improve Alliance relation with the colonies. But they're up to something. And if they sent Chief Williams, it must be big. Perhaps you should take it up with her. The Collectors just happened to pick a colony with one of my former crew? I don't buy it. It shouldn't be a surprise the Collectors are interested in you. Especially if they're working for the Reapers. They might be going after her to get to you. We should send a message to the Citadel. The Alliance can give us reinforcements. Not until you investigate. I don't want the Alliance getting in our way. Once you have the situation under control, I'll send the message personally. Send the coordinates. We'll head straight there. This is the most warning we've ever had, Shepard. Good luck. Here we go. Joker, set a course for Horizon. I've got to go see the professor. Aye, aye, Commander. Good. <laughs> Freaky. World's most terrifying bee. Tell me you have something. Yes. He's smiling. We got that protection. Let's do it.
Lilith, we've got a problem. Still can't calibrate the targeting matrix? Those defense towers are useless if we don't figure it out. Sorry, Chief. Getting our comm systems back online takes priority. Yeah. Okay. Surprised people haven't tried to blame that one on me, too. People out here don't trust the Alliance. It's nothing personal. It should be personal. She's trashy. What is that? <laughs> Surprise! Get everyone to the safe house. I'll cover you. Run! What's she shooting at? And she's frozen. That's one. Oop, they're slowly getting everybody. Oof. That's got to be one of the scariest things when you're hit with a paralytic, but you're still like awake and aware. So you can't move and you just have to deal with the horror of whatever is happening in front of you. It's absolutely horrifying. Ugh. Assuming control. That's freaky deaky. <laughs> oh, they're putting them in little pods, it looks like. Ooh. Let's see. You know what? Let's let's try out this new outfit of grunts. I don't think I I don't, I don't really use their alternate costumes. So let's see what he got. Alright, there we go. Concussive shot. Uh, high energy explosive charges, massive blast. Hmm. No, I think I'd rather have that. Weapon damage. Do it. We're ground side. Mort, you sure these armor upgrades will protect us from the seeker swarms? Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers, should confused detection make us invisible to swarms? In theory. In, in theory. theory. That sounds promising. Experimental technology. Only test is contact with seeker swarms. Look forward. You survive. <laughs> Loving the vote of confidence there, big guy. <laughs> First round. Damn, that ship is huge. 
It always throws me off when the ship, like, literally creates a storm around it. That's insane. The collectors are disrupting communications. We're on our own now. Those things look like the husks the Geth used on Eden Prime. I thought the Geth got that technology from Sovereign. Then your elusive man was right. Collectors must work for the Reapers. I'll take it. Heavy skin weave. Alright, good. I think that gives me extra health when I research it. We'll find out. Anything we need to take here? No. Sort of looks human. This one of the colonists? No. The Geth impaled their victims on giant spikes to turn them into husks. Yeah, or they call it dragon's teeth, I think. The collectors must have already had the husks. They want the colonists alive for something else. Uh... The collectors must be experimenting on the colonists. What are they up to? Maybe it's better not to know the details. Guess we'll find out when we stop them. These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced. Evolved. They still die when you shoot them. The collectors aren't getting away yeah? from victims. Let's move out. You're right. <laughs> you, you do have a point there. Your people. Gone. All these empty buildings. It's unsettling. Stuck. All right. What's in here? What's in here? On the ground now. Worthless. <laughs> well, while you guys are shooting, trying not to get killed. Just uh, rob these poor innocent people. <laughs> you only see nothing. It's uh, it's a mandatory donation for the cause. Payment for uh, attempted saving of their lives. Don't worry about it. All right, I think I just go down this way. Looks like some type of stasis field. Leaves victims helpless, but fully aware. They've been like this a long time. Short white line on top. Right here. There we go. Alright, let's do this. I 
I don't like seeing the bugs just floating around. It makes me really uncomfortable. Collector particle beam. I don't need that. Wait. Oh, that's a heavy weapon. I. Nah, that's not what I want. Oop! Here come more of them. Company, get out here now. Sheesh. You're, you're human. What are you doing out here? You need them right here. You had to hear them try to get in. Seems like it's hard to hide from the collectors. Those things are collectors. You mean they're real? Yeah. I thought they were just made up. You know, propaganda. To keep us in Alliance space. No, oh, they got Lilith. I, I saw her go down. Sten, too. They, they got damn near everybody. What's your name? What do you do here? We saved some. the LAN. Mechanic. I came down to check on the main grid after we lost our comm signals. And I heard screaming. I looked outside and there were swarms of bugs. Everyone they touched just froze. I, I, I sealed the doors. Damn it, it it's the Alliance's fault. They stationed that Chief Williams here and built those defense towers. It made us a target. Mm, but not... not quite. If you have defenses, we can use them against the Collector's ship. You'd need to calibrate the targeting system first. It's never worked right. One of us should be able to figure it out. We just need the location. Head for the main transmitter on the other side of the colony. Pretty hard to miss. The targeting controls are at the base. You know this colony and the equipment. You better come with us. Not a chance in hell. Coward. You'd probably just get in the way. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. I'll let you out, but I'm locking the door behind you. I'm not taking any chances. Good luck. I think you're gonna need it. Probably. All right, here we go. Back home to the nonsense. Enemies! No shield. Replay. Because of shot, ready. I will direct this personally. Ah. 
assuming control. I'll put them down. Attack. <clears throat> On the ground, now. You will mm. no pain, Shepard. Got it. Uh oh. Let's stay down. These things are the worst. Oh god, those things are the worst in the whole game. Impact shot. Die already. Those specific enemies can literally one-shot you. Oh, right. Don't tap the analog stick to sprint. I keep forgetting that, because I'm so used to games where that is the case. Which is, like, every first person ever. Now what's this? Alright, let's look around for some stuff we can use before we head forward. Oop. Nope, this isn't the path. Loaded onto the collector ship by now. We should hurry. Ooh, yay, monies. Don't mind me just robbing the helpless people of this <laughs> of this colony. Okay, but that looks cool. This colony is actually, like, pretty large. Look like there might be s whole cities on this planet. That's cool. I would like to explore more of it. Here we go. Home stretch. Ah, crap. Taking heavy fire. So look at that. One shot, instant loss of shield. Second shot. Instant loss of half HP. Uh oh. And it takes forever to get your health back. Bonk. There's the transmitter. Normandy, you copy. Joker here. Signal's weak, Commander, but we got you. Edie, can you get the colony's defense towers online? Errors in the calibration software are easily rectified, but it will take time to bring the towers to full power. It's fine I by me. I recommend a defensive posture. I will not be able to mask the increased generator output. The collectors will try to stop it. Good. Got any other helpful tips? Just one. Enforcements are closing in. I suggest you ready weapons. Not a bad idea. A 
assuming control of this form. If I must turn you on, Shepard, I will. Your attacks will tear you apart. Now. Hostile! I know you feel this. <laughs> Too, I believe. I need to heal. There we go. Get ready. Gotta yep. be more soon. Round two done. I think we only have to fight them off one more time. Ah! Right, it's this thing. Uh, the faces. Edie, we need that system online. A new one. Whatever it is, don't get too close. My attack was ineffective. Impact shot. Guardian anti ship batteries at 100%. I have control. That looks beautiful. No! Don't let him get away! There's nothing we can do. They're gone. Half the colony's in there. They took Egan and Sam and, and Lilith. Do something! There's nothing we can do with that this second. I did what I could. It was a good fight, Shepard. Shepard? Wait. I know that name. Sure, I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Commander Shepard. Captain of the Normandy. Oh, here we Spectre, go. Savior of the Citadel. You're in the presence of a god, Delan. Back from the dead. Oh, the good people we lost and you get left behind. Figures. Shh. Screw Shh. this. I'm done with you alliance types. I 
I thought you were dead, Commander. We all did. It's been too long, Ash. How have you been? That's it? You show up after two years and act like nothing's happened? I would have followed you anywhere, Commander. I thought you were gone. I... You were more than our Commander. Why didn't you try to contact me? Why didn't you let me know you were alive? Not my choice. I spent the last two years in some kind of coma while Cerberus rebuilt me. You're with Cerberus now? Garrus, too? I can't believe the reports were right. Reports? You mean you already knew? Alliance Intel said Cerberus could be behind our missing colonies. I got a tip that this one could be the next to get hit. I went to Anderson, but he wouldn't talk. But there were rumors that you weren't dead. Worse, that you were working for the enemy. Our colonies are disappearing. The Alliance turned its back on them. Cerberus is the only group willing to do something about it. Bullshit. I know what Cerberus is like. They talk about putting humans first, but at what cost? I wanted to believe that you were alive. I just never expected anything like this. You've turned your back on everything we stood for. Ash, you know me. You know I'd only do this for the right reason. You saw it yourself. The Collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reavers. I'd like to believe you, Shepard, but I don't trust Cerberus. And it worries me that you do. What did they do to you? What if they're behind it? They did what, what the they had with to the collectors? do. Damn it, Williams. You're so focused on Cerberus that you're ignoring the real threat. You're letting how you feel about their history get in the way of facts. Or maybe you feel like you owe Cerberus because they saved you. Maybe it's you. No, Doesn't you're matter. stupid. That's all it is. I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. It's in my blood. I'm reporting back to the Citadel. I'll let them decide if they believe your story. So long, Ash. So long, Commander. Good luck. I want to just beat her upside the head right now. Joker, send the shuttle to pick us up. I've had enough of this colony. I hate her. Colony defense. Shepard, good work on Horizon. Hopefully the Collectors will think twice before attacking another colony. It's not a victory. We interrupted the Collectors, but they still abducted half the colony. That's better than an entire colony, and more than we've accomplished since the abductions began. The Collectors will be more careful now, but I think we can find another way to lure them in. Ash said the Alliance got a tip about me and Cerberus. Was that you? I may have let it slip that you were alive, and with Cerberus. You risked the lives of my friend, my crew, and that entire colony, just to oh lure the Collectors God. there? A calculated risk. I suspected the Collectors were looking for you, or people connected to you. Now I know for certain. I told you I wouldn't sit and wait while the Reapers and Collectors gather strength. Besides, they would have hit another colony eventually, and without a way to predict which one, they would have abducted everyone. We have to make sure they don't abduct anyone else. I want the Collectors stopped for that very reason. That's why we're doing this, Shepard. I'm devoting all resources to finding a way through the Omega-4 relay. We have to hit them where they live. Your team will need to be strong, as will their resolve. There's no looking back. The same goes for you. Can I assume you put your past relationships behind you? I'm free, clear, and focused on the mission. That's what I like to hear. Shepard, once you find a way through the Omega-4 relay to the Collector homeworld, there's no guarantee you'll return. To have any hope of surviving, you and your entire team must be fully committed to this. Let me worry about them. You just find us a way to the Collector homeworld. I just want to be upfront about your odds. You'll need everyone at their best. 
I've forwarded three more dossiers. Keep building your team while I find a way through the relay. And be careful, Shepard. The collectors will be watching you. I'll make sure to put on a good show then. Ain't no problem for me. Ain't no problem for me. I guess we're really me. gonna do it. Hit the Omega-4 relay. Take the fight to the collectors in person. Looking forward to the action. After seeing what those bastards did on Horizon though, makes you think. They're powerful, but we've got a few tricks for them. If anyone can stop them, we can. No argument there, Commander. Horizon just made it hit home. What we're doing, what we're up against. Gonna go take care of a little unfinished business. I imagine everyone else is too. Getting some closure, you know? What do we got? Oh, yep. Extra health. Less damage. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Later, updating crew dental records. All Cerberus personnel have cyanide capsules and molars. Primitive. Ocular nerve flashbangs harder to disarm. Anything else? Have you got a minute to <laughs> Later, talk? Up anything else? That's actually kind of funny. I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Ooh, Thane. Yes. Commander, you received a new message at your... All right, hang on. The report mentioned that Ashley Williams was there. How did that go? There's not much to say. The past is the past. I understand. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages. Operative Lawson would like to see you at her station. Operative Taylor would like to see you over in the armory. Anything else, Commander? I'll be here if you need anything. All right, so Jacob and Commander Steve oh. back in Alliance HQ. Commander Shepard. I need to discuss a sensitive matter with you privately. I'll take this in my quarters. Let's see what the uh, what the admiral has in mind for us. I call me. Just this morning I received word that the Batarians arrested her. They're holding her in a secret prison outpost on terrorism charges. I need you to infiltrate the prison and get her out of there. As a favor to me, I'm asking you to go in alone. I have a hell of a squad with me. I'm sure they'd help out. Kenson is my friend. If the Batarians see a squad of armed soldiers, they'll kill her. This is serious, Commander. Go in with discretion, or don't go at all. I'll make this a priority. The prison is hidden underground at a Batarian outpost in Aratat. I'll upload the coordinates now. Once she's secure, confirm her discovery. We'll debrief you when you're back. Got it. Hack it out. Oh my god, that's the DLC! Okay, so this is DLC that is automatically included um, for the second game in the trilogy, but it was something you had to purchase in the original, and I did not do that. So I think it's called The Arrival or something. I have never seen anything from it, ever. So, what we do when we get to those missions, completely blind. 
I know nothing except like what the consequences are of it later. What the hell kind of game are you playing, Shepard? You did the buddy act when I had the gun on that Cerberus scientist, telling me you understood. Now I find out you're working for Cerberus? Tests were done on me that you can't even imagine. For years, Cerberus did them. They tortured me, they used me as a damn lab rat. And now you're teaming up with them like they're any other Merc band? I've got my own team now, Shepard. And I kill any Cerberus team I can find. If I run into you, don't expect any different. Commander, the Alliance soldiers here gave me this contact information. I hope this reaches you. You said you were trying to stop those collectors. They took my son and my brother. Have you found them? Do you know where they are? I know you're looking, but so many people are just gone. Every family lost someone. The children are the worst. Empty desks at the schools, winter clothes that never got worn. Please, the Alliance isn't doing anything. The Council isn't doing anything. If you can find our people, I'm begging you to do something. Tell me something I can do. Tell me anything. Robin Reeve We're aware that your old friend, Liara Tassoni, has been hunting for the Shadow Broker for several years. We wouldn't mind helping her in that hunt, given the, given the Broker's past work for the Collectors. We recently uncovered some information that might, that might give Liara a lead on where to find the Shadow Broker's base of operations, but unfortunately she doesn't have much faith in Cerberus intel. If you'd visit Ilium and pass it on to her as a gesture of goodwill, we'd appreciate it. Alright, so we're gonna do the, the single most important mission in this entire game. Let's go. The single most important mission in the entire game. And we are going to recruit my Quarian Queen. Updated incendiary. Um, upgrade his concussive. Quispy. Shepard, our data indicates that Tally is somewhere in these ruins. There is considerable geth activity and an environmental hazard. Solar output has overwhelmed Hastrum's protective magnetosphere. Exposure to direct sunlight will damage your shields. Alright. You know, I actually just saw a post recently, and it was like, the saddest, most under underappreciated death in all of Mass Effect. And it was like making this whole big song and dance about it being emotional so and shame, depressing. No and then you get to the bottom of the article, which is actually a, a decent size, I'd say. And it's literally about that bug that just walked into the sun and crisped to death. And it's just so dumb. It's so dumb. Whoop, drop ship. Oop. Shielded. One more back here. What less to worry about? My shields are down.
I would not like to end up a bucket of KFC, please. So it's raining out, and that is so nice. And I'm really hoping we get some thunder and lightning too. Because as, as many of you know, uh, rain, especially like thunderstorm rain, and the louder the better, um, it is one of my like comfort triggers. Uh, rain is Rain and thunder is the white noise that puts me to sleep when I have trouble with my insomnia. So anytime we get like a rainstorm, it's it's very good for me. This is Commander Shepard of the Normandy. Can we provide assistance? What's the status of your team? How many of you are left? We were a small squad, dozen Marines plus the science team. We're down to half strength now. Made the synthetic bastards pay for it, though. What brought you this deep into Geth controlled space? You're asking the wrong person, Shepard. I just point and shoot. Something about the sun. It's going bad faster than it should. Some kind of energy problem. Any idea where the Geth came from? Do we have to worry about the Geth sending in reinforcements? I don't think so. Their patrol ship hasn't lifted off again. The radiation blocks all off-world communication. All right, so up? we can what be there they have in a few is what Take they have, plain and simple. Direct sunlight fries your shields all to hell. We're bunkered down at base camp across the valley. I left Tally Zora at a secure shelter that doubled back to all the choke point. Getting Tally out safely is our top priority. If you can extract her, we'll keep them off you. You've got confirmation that the Geth haven't reached Talia? yet? Affirmative. Left my best men with her. When you get here, you can talk to her on the comm. Every Marine on this rock is sworn to protect Tally Zora. As long as one of us is still drawing air, she'll be safe. Hold position. We'll hit their back ranks. Wait! Watch your ass! We got a dropship coming in! There goes three of those marines. So now they're down to what? Two, three? Grab the demo charges in the buildings nearby. Use them to clear a path. I hate this because I am a hundred percent confident that Shepard is capable of just jumping that. Like I am actually fully confident. No doubt whatsoever in my mind that he could jump that. There is plenty of space. And it's not that high up. Oop, I hear their chirping sounds. Oh, she's 
chasing after me. Watch for drones. Prime down. Closed. We've got half the charges. Now we need the other half. Enemy. Nope. <laughs> I tried to step back in. I messed up. Ah well. Hi, Michael. How you doing? Alright, we got both charges. That is a really interesting question, though. If stars and things of that nature start dying way faster than their normal lifespans, then what the heck is happening? What's causing it? You know, I, I would love to see the kind of, like, tech or science behind something involving, like, killing a star. Manually. That was underwhelming. Yeah, see, look, we absolutely could have just hopped over it, but whatever. Anything to drag out the level slightly longer. Out of my way. This is valuable. Gorian architecture. 
Sure. There's two words you don't expect to hear to get. Our ancestors walked these halls with uncovered heads. The sun must have been normal back then. So much space. Walls of stone. It's amazing. I wish my friends could see it. I wish Shepard were here. Oh, well, ask and ye shall receive. For those who didn't hear, that last thing she said was, I wish Shepard was here. What a coincidence. Here I come to save the day. Hello? Is anyone there? Tally, it's Shepard. I'm sorry, everyone here is dead. Any survivors must have fallen back. We knew this mission was high risk. Damn it. And what are you doing here, Shepard? We're in the middle of Geth space. <laughs> I you literally came here just to get you. <laughs> that is exclusively the reason I am here. Got me into the observatory. From where you are, it's through the door and across the field. I got the data I needed, and I'm safe for now, but I've got a lot of geth outside. Would it help if I brought in the Normandy? Doubtful. These buildings are centuries old. If you bring down heavy fire, this whole place could collapse on us. Is anyone else still with you, or are you alone out there? Rieger had a team of Marines covering me when I ran for the observatory. At least some of them are still alive. I can hear them firing at the get outside. It looks like somebody sealed the door against the get, and the console is damaged. Can you get it open on your end? Uh, let me see. Yes, I can do it. Here. Should be unlocked now. Be careful, Shepard, and please, do what you can to keep Rieger alive. Here we go. They've seen us. You're a big coward. The drones can hide! Not what I meant to do. Drones, where's the prime? One less to worry about. There we go. Enemy. All right, let's go through. We made it. Someone's firing rockets at you. 
True. Get their near platoon True. strength, but the Colossus is the worst part. It's got a repair protocol. Huddles up and fixes itself. I can't get a clear shot while it's down like that. I tried to move in closer, and one of the bastards punched a shot clean through my suit. How bad is your suit damage? Combat seals clamp down to isolate contamination, and I'm swimming in antibiotics. Geth might get me, but I'm not gonna die from an infection in the middle of a battle that's just insulting. Yeet. What can you tell me about the battlefield? Right side's got a catwalk with a sniper perch. You could wreak some havoc from there, but none of my men made it past the Geth. The middle's got cover, but the damn Colossus has a clear shot at you the whole time, and you've got Geth coming in from both sides. The left gives you some cover from the Colossus, but your ass is hanging out for the Geth. That's how I got shot. Any ideas on how to deal with the Colossus? Standard protocol with armature class units is to sabotage the shields and whittle it down, you know? Kill it with bug bites. But the repair protocol blows that plan to hell. You try to wear it down, it just huddles up and fixes itself. So whatever we do has to scrap that bastard fast. Probably means getting up close, past that cover. We need to get to Tally. Got any ideas? Just one. I'm not moving so well, but I can still pull a trigger. I got a rocket launcher that the sun hasn't fried yet. You move in close. I'll keep the Colossus busy. Maybe even drop its shields. With luck, you'll be able to finish it off. You've done enough, Rieger. You don't need to throw your life away. I wasn't asking your permission. My job is to keep Tally safe. <sighs> we don't have enough people on our side for you to take one for the team. Stand down! I'm not gonna stand there while you run into enemy fire. They killed my whole squad. And if you want to honor your squad, watch my back. I need you here in case they bring reinforcements. <clears throat> All right, Shepard. We'll do it your way. Hit him for me. Keep us alive. Hostile! <sighs> Go, go, go. Ooh. That was a straight shot. Nothing I could do, damn. Okay, maybe not the best approach. I think my issue was that I didn't stop them from moving forward, so they managed to flank me. And this game has absolutely no way to. My job is to keep Tally safe. We don't have enough people on our side uh, for you to take one for the team. You don't have the ability Stand to down. just heal. Trouble! Go. Yes. Then stay down. They're through my shield! Oof. 
didn't mean to get up. Okay. Come on, come on. There we go. Go, 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 go. <clears throat> Oof. We made it. We made it. Let's go. Just let me finish this download. Damn, she killed a few on her own. Thank you, Shepard. If not for you, I would never have made it out of this room. This whole mission has been a disaster. I wish I'd joined you back on Freedom's Progress, but I couldn't let anyone take my place on something this risky. A lot of Quarians lost their lives here. Was it worth it? I don't know, Shepard. It wasn't my call. The Admiralty Board believed the information here was worth sacrificing all our lives for. I have to believe that they know what's best. I didn't ask what some admiral thought. I asked what you thought. A lot of people died here. Some of them were my friends. All of them were good at their jobs. That damn data better be worth it. The price was too high. What can you tell me about your research here? Haystrom's sun is destabilizing. Back when this was a Quarian colony, it was a normal star. It shouldn't change that quickly. Any idea what's destabilizing the sun? If I had to guess, I'd say that it was dark energy affecting the interior of the star. The effect is similar to when stars blow off mass to enter a red giant phase. But Haystrom's sun is far too young for this to be natural. Whatever the reason, I'm glad I could help. Once you deliver that data, I could use you on the Normandy. I promised to see this mission through. I did. I can leave with you and send the data to the fleet. And if the Admirals have a problem with it, they can go to hell. I just watched the rest of my team die. Maybe not the whole rest of your team, ma'am. Rieger, you made it. Your old captain's as good as you said. Damn Colossus never stood a chance. If need be, the Normandy can get you out of here, Rieger. Well, the Geth didn't damage our ship. As long as we get out of here before reinforcements show up, we'll be fine. Actually, I won't be going with you. I'm joining Commander Shepard. I'll pass the data to the Admiralty board and let him know what happened. She's all yours now, Shepard. Keep her safe. Yes, sir. The Quarian. Yes. Yes. My Quarian Queen. Cerberus saw footage of you in action, Talizora. 
We're looking forward to having you on the team. Your engineering expertise will really benefit the mission. I don't know who you are, but Silver is threatened with the security of the migrant fleet. Don't make nice. <laughs> That's why you're here, Tally. I need people who aren't Cerberus. People I can trust. I wasn't part of what happened to the migrant fleet. But I understand your distrust. I hope we'll get past that as we work together. I assumed that you were undercover, Shepard. Maybe even planning to blow Cerberus up. If that's the case, I'll loan you a grenade. Otherwise, I'm here for you. Not for them. If it helps, check out the Normandy while you're here. We've gotten a few upgrades. I'll get Tally Zora the necessary security clearance to access our systems. Please do. I can't be part of your team if I don't know how the ship works. Remember, Shepard, these people thought enslaving Thorian creepers and Rachni was a good idea. I'll be in engineering. Don't forget to introduce yourself to Edie, the ship's new artificial intelligence. <laughs> Turns back. The what? <laughs> the what? Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Having trouble working between your interruptions and Edie's insistence that insane experiments endanger entire crew. Hard to concentrate. Affecting morale. Anything else? Have you got a minute to talk? Having trouble... Anything else? Is the lab working well for Quite you? satisfactory. Found a few surveillance bugs. Destroyed most of them. Just need more samples. More collector data. We'll be here at Man, you. I want... There is one specific thing. One specific conversation I want out of him so badly. I had a wonderful chat with your friend Tally. She's not what I expected from her psych report. I like her. Tally's a good friend. We've been through a lot together. My female intuition says she wants to be more than just good friends. I always felt there might have been some chemistry there. There is. It's in her body. <laughs> how she turns to you when you enter the room. How she watches your every move. Corians are so fascinating to me. But they also make me a little sad. Why do they make you sad? Their environment suits are so beautiful, but with their immune systems, they're trapped inside. I wonder what they look like under those helmets, or what their skin feels like under those suits. Hmm. Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages. Operative Lawson would like to see... Operative Taylor would like... Jack would like to see you down in her hide. Okay. Anything else, Commander? I'll be here. So now Commander Jack wants to talk to me as well. What tournament. do we got? Commander Shepard, per Talizora Vasnima's request included with her data delivery from Haystrom, the Admiralty Board has approved her transfer to your command. She has been informed that additional duties to the migrant fleet may still be necessary on occasion, but has been given extended leeway to determine when her mission with you is considered complete. This choice was hers, but your role as de facto captain during her pilgrimage may have caused her to be more susceptible to your request. The Admiralty Board trusts that you will treat your new crew member with the respect due to an honored member of the fleet. Should any harm come to her due to negligence on your part, this board will take severe and appropriate action. Admiral Rail Zora, Migrant Fleet Admiralty Board. So, uh, you notice that name? Tali Zora and Rail Zora. I just got threatened by her father. Don't you love it? Hang on. All right. But we're coming up on two hours. I still need to go eat dinner, and I think we've made really good progress. We got two new team members. Uh, we managed to get through Horizon. So it looks like we've officially gone into loyalty mission territory, which I think is going... decided it wanted to fall out. Oh well, must not have been in properly. Um, we're heading into loyalty mission territory, which I think is going to be a lot of fun and very interesting, and especially for people who like games that invest you into the characters, or at least try to. Uh, it's very good that, you know, you witness those, because it gives you a lot of character development, it gives you a lot of background, and I, I think they're going to be really good and a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of fun, really interesting to do. 
Uh, so that's what we're going to be doing next week. Uh, I'm still trying to figure out exactly what I want to do with Kingdom Hearts. I'm thinking I should just stream 358 days over to the cutscenes. Um, to, starting tomorrow. And I might record the gameplay on the side. And have them be standalone videos for people to watch. So that I don't have to worry about lag issues and running around aimlessly on the air. Um, so I think I'm going to do it that way, because that might be best. Uh, if I finish the cutscenes on, uh, you know, if I finish the cutscenes tomorrow, then I will just play something else on Thursday. Maybe I'll do a, uh, double episode of Resident Evil Village. But, it, you know, if not, I'll finish them on Thursday, and we'll just see where we can go from there. Um, and, you know, as I just said, on Saturday we'll be playing more Village. Uh, so, you know, make sure you guys look forward to whatever we got. I think I am going to raid... You know what? I'm going to raid our Fox Den certified bomb dropper, Mr. Pop Killed Him, who is an absolutely fantastic and supportive member of our group. We all love and appreciate the man very, very much. And he's recently been having a bit of a rough time when it comes to his confidence as a streamer. So I think it would be very important for us to show him some love. And we are going to do just that. Here is our raid message, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you tune in to whichever of those games that I listed before that you are interested in. Uh, one more time, it will be Kingdom Hearts tomorrow and Thursday if it goes unfinished. Resident Evil Village on Thursday if we do finish Kingdom Hearts and Village again on Saturday coming back with this one more time on Monday so make sure you look forward to whichever one of those has your attention but until then I hope you all have a wonderful night a wonderful start to your week and I hope to see you in the next episode have a good night everybody